All right, quickly, let's, uh, you know, it's a game day prediction, and I don't want you to go over the the stretch of viewing one hour plus or 90 minutes of content to be able to get your bets. Like I always say, the bets, it's uh, the daily one. It's easier that we... So this is the Friday game day prediction, and there are not too many games that will go down today, but I would still try. This is my prediction. And for those who are, you know, there are these people who... Let's go and see the one that he gets wrong so that we use it to mock him. It's a prediction. And uh, anybody can get predictions right. Anybody can get it wrong. This is mine. You don't have to agree with it. But I have a knack of getting a lot of them right. Maybe 80, 70 to 80%. And that's good as far as I'm concerned. If it's an exam, I'm in the upper class. Let's look at the matches that are going to go down. 745 tonight, Madagascar Forest and Sheffield. United. Chevy United nearly promoted just like Nottingham Forest was last season. But Nottingham Forest, when they started the season, they reinforced the team, the ball players. They knew they were in a dog fight. They were going to fight for survival. Their president was always sitting on the edge of the seat, but they finally survived thanks to the goals. Six in five go games. Uh, is it six, seven, is five, seven in five games. So, uh, uh, no, six and five actually, towards the end of the season, that brought them, you know, survivor. And he's also started again this season. First game on his birthday, the day his wife delivered his baby, the, he scored a goal against Arsenal at the Emirates. Uh, last season, when they went to the Emirates, they were trash. This time around, they survived, uh, even though they lost. It was two goals to one respectable. They're coming home. Uh, their home form also was uh, on the back of on the back end of what saved them last season. They drew with. Uh, with City, if I'm not mistaken, or they beat City, they beat Arsenal, they beat Liverpool, you know, at home, they're playing against Sheffield. They would have learned one or two things that you need to start picking this point pretty early. Like it or not, whether they played very well against Arsenal, they end up losing, so they didn't win in that game. They would want to pick up points in this one. So, I'll go with Nottingham Forest flatter to win. Sheffield also didn't win last weekend, so they would want to come and get something here, but I think they'll win this one. Uh, safe bet. If you're doing combos in any of the betting platforms, I think all the betting platforms have combos. You can do Nordica Forest to win and over 1.5. Now, what that combo does is to give you higher odds and, um, you know, put you on the safe side. And especially if you're accumulating to put you on the safe side, Nordica Forest to win and over 1.5, pretty much very good. I don't think this game will end 1-0 anyway. So, that's a good one. And the difficult one is the game in France, the Mets versus uh, Marcel game. Uh, pretty much easy to see because Marcel is a bigger team to win this game, but I don't think that is easy to see. The two of them don't have a good form in the last five, and then their head-to-head -head always seems to present more of a draw. 1-1, uh, 1-1, one, 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 or 1-0, one, you know, in, 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 in regular frequency. So in this game, I might say that uh, predicting draw is a very hard one because anything can happen. So I hardly predict the draw, but I could say 1.5 one, one, uh, 1. is certainty in this game. Um, both teams to score also look certain, but you can't put that in a combo. You can't put that on an accumulator. The, what, the one thing you can put on an accumulator is over 1.5. Bayern going away to Werder Bremen. Bayern lost last week in the uh, community, or uh, sorry, in the Super Cup, the German Super Cup, three goes to nothing to RB Leipzig. Uh, Harry Kane is going to have his debut. He's had to train with his teammate now. His league debut with Bayern Munich, and he's already hoping to win the Ballon d'Or with Bayern Munich. I think that Bayern are going to win. This game is going to be over 2.5. I don't know if both teams will score, but Werder Bremen have always been a difficult team to play against for Bayern, going away to play against them. This game might provide a platform for over, uh, both teams to score, but the surest one for me, I'm going to pick Bayern to win. It's a risk. The team is not really that good right now, but they would, I think they will win in this game. And one coach that I've already predicted will be sacked before the end of the season is Thomas Tuchel. Uh, but that doesn't stop them from winning this game. I think they'll win over 2.5. is shown on this one. Heracles playing against Neckley in the Dutch uh, league, which is one of the very complicated ones. Just pick this one for over 1.5 to fill up your accumulator. Uh, the season, I've not started. I've not, we've not gotten a run to be able to say, okay, there is a predictable pattern. So it's still going to be a bit difficult. Mallorca playing against Villarreal. This is a goose game, okay? So if you're picking for accumulator, over 1.5 is safe. Like I always say, at the beginning of the season, go for the safe bets. There's going to come a time in the season from week 5, week 6, where you can start taking big risks. But for now, go for the safe one, especially when you're betting online, so that you can, you know, accrue more money on your bet account and, you know, grow it. Then there is the Valencia playing against Las Palmas. I think that Valencia will win this one. I think, again, a combo of Valencia to win and over 1.5, is as safe as they come. That's all the game there is 
today that I can take. Now, it doesn't mean that there are no other games. There are games in the uh, Cup Champions League. But I like to predict games that I've been able to reset. I know their players are formed, the ones that are injured, the ones that are playing. And then on the strength of that, I can be able to say, okay, based on this, who's replacing this? Not players, I, teams that I don't know. One team is KMKM KM of Zanzibar, St. George of Ethiopia. I've not watched them in the last five, six, seven eight or ten years and then i'll go and predict for you so there are a lot of other games even in south america but i've not researched them so i'm not going to touch on that but be very sure that uh, we would have game reviews on game days we will have predictions on game days we would also have uh you know a whole lot of other shows what we ask we're not selling this prediction is subscribe to our youtube channel please drop a comment if you like what we're doing, whatever I think you think we, we need to improve on, we will try to do that. Thank you very much once again. I wish everybody was betting the very best of luck. My name is Ada Fimati. You're going to, you love to call me the Lego Tomorrow Sports. Let's do this again tomorrow. I will bring you games for Saturdays and then on Sunday I'll bring you games. But definitely after the game, the Bayern game and the game um, between Tottenham and, sorry, Nottingham Forest and Sheffield. I will give you my review of those games. Tomorrow, or probably later this evening, you would have my prediction for Saturday's game. Thank you very much, and have a wonderful weekend.